big show infocom 2023 new hp poly devices uh, what, did, what did we see there mel so let's talk about some more ai they have some on device like like you called out what's gonna happen some on device ai um they introduced two new products one is the poly studio x52 all-in-one video bar and that's really for kind of their mid-size conference rooms um, and then they also introduced a new headset um, which is called the Polyger, Poly Voyager. I just combined those two. Poly Voyager Surround 80 UC. Um, wow, that just that, uh, rolls right off the tongue, right. doesn't it? I know. Those are, they're, some of these are they're hard to get out. Um, they also introduced an update to their operating system and the software release has like the, the director AI to keep people focused, keep the camera focused. Really all these are designed for hybrid work. So when you've got people who are at home and then you've got people in the conference room, everybody, the, the director, the AI director focuses on the person who's talking. So each person is seen, even if they're in the corner of a room, no matter who's talking. What it also does is that there's they have some technology that has detected glass walls and able to detect whether somebody is in or outside of the glass wall. So it's not picking up on people walking by like somebody who just walked by behind me, although I'm not in a glass wall. Um, and allows the the meeting organizer to kind of put this perimeter around. So from a sound perspective, it eliminates like the the echo and the kind of noise reduction that you would normally get in glass conference rooms. But then also it get, gives you that sort of, it creates kind of a wall where there is glass um, to make these meeting spaces, one, more equitable for the people who are not in the room, but also just the sound better and everything for the people who are in the room. Um, they have all kinds of these bars. I know you've reviewed several of them before. I mean, they do a great job with sound. I haven't seen this one yet, but at, um, what was that in Orlando? I, I saw a bunch of them. I mean, they really do. Their sound is really just kind of top notch, I think. And I did get a demo of this, um, of these online demo. And the way that the camera switches from one person to another while they're talking without somebody fumbling around and making the switch of like, oh, he's talking, she's talking. It just picks up on the person's voice. The camera's focused there and it doesn't have where people are looking at the person like this, but they're not on the camera. You know, it doesn't have that awkwardness of where people are looking and it just makes you feel like you're in a room having a conversation with people. So it's really meant for hybrid work, but they really have, you know, infused this AI into it to make it easier for people to use and make it seamless. So... So yeah, the company's been, uh, Polly's been working on this for, for a long time and, you know, the audio for even, you know, longer. Um, mm -hmm. But I, I can't imagine having a good hybrid work experience across the enterprise without being able to do face separation. Mm -hmm. I mean, to me, um, you know, one of the biggest ways to, I mean, remote, all remote, if, if you think about it, was a little easier because everybody was on a notebook PC. Now, I'm not saying easier. I just mean easier to pull off. One, right. one person uh, got a cube, right? Uh, sorry, a square uh, on the screen. Yeah. And I'm, I'm surprised how many companies haven't upgraded their, um, their room equipment to technologies like that. I think they will. <laughs> I think they'll realize that it's an investment if they want people to come into the office and have a good hybrid work experience. I, I, I think some might be saying, hey, if I upgrade my video equipment in the rooms, that's going to motivate more, you know, if I don't do that, it's gonna motivate people to come in to the office. I think it's gonna have the opposite effect. It's just gonna yeah. piss everybody off and lower their uh, productivity. 